Hello, this is PD Model Master, and this is a slightly different picture for you this time. Uh, you're always used to me drawing cars and people and uh, dogs. Well, this is slightly different. The reason why I do those is because a lot of people want them drawing and they've got pets or relatives, so they're passionate about the cars when I do the car show, so I do an awful lot of cars. Uh, but this time I've got for you a bee, a British bee, a British bumblebee to be exact. Uh, the Latin name, the posh zoological name for it is the Bombus terrestris. So this is the uh, your common British bumblebee that you see buzzing around the gardens in the uh, in the UK. Anyone who knows me knows I've got a passion for bees because they are the one species right now which keep us alive more than anything. They pollinate pretty much everything that we eat and if they went, if they died, we would not be far behind them. And they are on a massive decline in the last 20 years. 50% of the populations of these, all various different types of bees have dropped. So I, I'm, I'm passionate about bees to the point where my whole garden is geared around having plants in there to keep them healthy, keep them going through the summer months to be strong enough to survive through the winter. So I think everyone should do the same because they are very important to us and we need them much more than they need us. So this took me, I think, around, it wasn't very long. It was probably about six hours, probably seven hours maximum. And uh, a lovely lady that I work with called Helen um, asked me to do this because she wanted something for a kitchen and she loves bees as well and I've got loads of bee drawings on the go for for myself for various different people who've asked them asked them to be done and I'm actually working well I've finished my second one for Helen now which she'll be pleased to hear uh, so yeah I, I love drawing this because anything technical where you've got like the close detail of the wings and the the close-up of the fur, the, the detail of the legs that I love doing and this particular picture shows it sat on what's called a purple salvia which for any of you bee enthusiasts out there will know that that is a very good uh, plant for them to to keep them strong along with the likes of your buddleia uh, and your herb plants so that's it that's the finished picture I will be uploading my other pictures which I've been meaning to catch up on very soon so I will see you again soon. Goodbye.